The presence of different places of worship side by side in brickfields <coughs> is proof of religious acceptance in Malaysia. Mutual regard and appreciation were evident as advocates of moderation took part in a harmony walk along Jalan Sultan Abdul Samad and Jalan Bahala in an area considered to be an integral part of old Kuala Lumpur. Star Publications Group Managing Director and Chief Executive Officer Datuk Seri Wang Chun Wai says the walk emphasizes the fact that Malaysians are tolerant people who embrace multiculturalism. Um, we want to emphasize the point that look, um, all religion, regardless of what religion, basically has one thing in common. It promotes goodwill, it promotes tolerance, it promotes uh, patience, forgiveness. And for me, it's really an educational trip. Uh, not just a walk for harmony, not just a walk for moderation, but it's really an educational trip. And I will rec recommend it to all Malaysians who live in KL or they live outside KL, come to visit Brickfields. We hope to do one in Melaka uh, before the uh, National Day. Uh, we are still in the uh, planning stages and we hope that uh, we may want to open it to Malaysians and have a bigger say in the state outside. Saturday's walk was a follow-up to the first Harmony Walk held in Jalan Masjid Kapitan Keling in Penang last month. The YMCA was the gathering point and the walk meandered around the Sam Kao Temple, Tamil Methodist Church, Sri Sakti Karpaga Vinayagar Temple and Buddhist Maha Vihara. Participants included one Malaysia Foundation trustee, Tan Sri Li Lam Thai, Asian Strategy and Leadership Institute Centre of Public Policy Studies Chairman Tan Sri Ramon Navaratnam, Social Activist Datin Paduka Marina Mahathir and Women's Aid Organisation Executive Director Ivy Josiah. The star organised the second instalment of the Harmony Walk as part of the Voices of Moderation campaign in support of racial and religious harmony.